our next game is going to be this. It's going to be the Eagles and the Pats, the Eagles and the Pats. And you know what? This one is going to be a big hyped up game as well, too. I know a lot of people are probably going to look at this one and everybody's probably going to go the same way that I'm going here and the same way that Jeff is going here. But, you know, you're just not going to be stupid. That's all it is. Just don't be dumb. You know, the Eagles were great. They are a great team. You know what I mean? And, you know, I pissed off some people when I said that they were, you know, everything's a little robotic with them, even though they're really good. But, no, this is a hell of a team. Everybody, every team in the league would love to have who they have in the trenches on both sides of the ball. You know, everybody wants to have their front seven and their offensive line. I'm telling you, nobody would, nobody would want to not have that group. And so pretty much that sets them apart from everybody. But somebody that knows how to really dissect groups like that is the man himself, Bill M.F. and Belichick. And I'm telling you right now, Belichick, this is his revenge year because I know he's on a short leash. It, it, they can say what they want, but I know him and Kraft had that talk. If we're looking like how we did last year, Bill, I'm going to have to have you act like I didn't fire you and retire. Okay? So – he knows he's on the hottest seats he's the hottest seat he's ever been on because at the end of the day you start to look at the patriots say do they need a new voice in the locker room and i say not yet but still people gonna talk but i'm gonna just end it right there and i'm taking the patch plus four okay eagles i know you're gonna show up you're gonna show out you're gonna look good but the pats are gonna make you make you play they're gonna make you play but I know one thing, though, the Eagles have been really, really successful against the Patriots their last few times that they played against them. And I know that's something that you can take into uh, fruition for this spot right here as well, too. Jeff, your thoughts? Uh, true number three and a half with a 46 and a half. Uh, this did spike to as high as five and a half, six. Now money's coming in back on the Pats. Uh, four at Circa, three and a half at South Point and Westgate uh, right now. Uh, with a 45, uh, you know, this has the making where I think the public will be on the Eagles, the, the the sharper guys will be on the Pats. I would not be shocked if the Pats not only covered this game, but stole this game and won outright 24-20. On the same side, I wouldn't be shocked if the Eagles won by double digits. The problem here is the Pats offensive line. And if this Eagles defense with their front seven starts to put pressure on Mac. It's going to be a long, long, long day and could get ugly. So I'm going to take the Pats plus the four and a half here, but I do know deep down if Mac starts chucking and ducking and throws a couple picks, this game could get ugly, but we'll, we'll take the Pats in the home opener and build to try to steal one. 